All right, match two. Giganta Prowess back again. And hey, this is a Giganta Prowess hand if I've ever seen one. So let's see. Um, already. All right. See, and there is something to be said about just going fast. Um, and I think I will just play out a Abbot here, even though I can't play whatever it plays, just as a 2-1 prowess creature. Ooh, it's kind of a, an unfortunate one to reveal, but it's usually, I think, good to just not really pay attention to whatever Abbot exiles. It could have literally been anything. Um, you know, it's, it's basically just playing a 2-mana for a 2-1. It, it's arguable. It's actually an interesting question. If if we could choose between using the ability or not, when we know that we can't hit anything off it on turn two, would we still use the ability? You know, the, the fact that there is an argument to be made that maybe we should, I think does tell you that it's not really worth fretting over. Nice. Obviously, Lava Dart would have been slightly better, but I'll take this. Could have gone for face, actually. It's the same thing. This lets me push through three with Abbott. I wonder if this is Titan, uh, Titan Shift. It's been a while. Hopefully they don't have Anger of the Gods here. Because I do think we've got Lethal. Next turn, actually, maybe not, because I forgot this Flame Slash can't exactly hit creatures, so hopefully we draw another Burn Spell. Hopefully they play a Dry to the Elysian Grove. That'd be sweet. Alright, or just Concede. I guess that works, too. I guess they were, they were mana screwed, I guess. Didn't have Lightning Bolt, and... Yeah, I don't know. Well, believe it or not, I actually do think Blood Moon is pretty good here. Um, obviously, they can they usually have enough basic for us that they're fully functional with it, except that no Field of the Dead triggers, no Valakut triggers, and that usually that should be enough to get us there. Is there anything else we need to bring in? Um, Flame Slash is good against Dryad, but I don't know if they're playing Dryad or not. I don't know if that's worth it in... The Titan decks. They've got, already got all the mountains they need. It doesn't really... They don't really need to turn all their lands into mountains. <sighs> yeah, and the rest... The rest to make sense. It's just our regular old shell. Doing its regular old things. Well, can't really throw this hand back. It's a little bit disappointing, though, that for the, trying to go for max speed, I still end up only having, like, one prowess creature in my hand, but what can you do? Well, that's... Hopefully that's a good sign. Well, there's another prowess creature. Uh, black. Okay, it's something. Okay, Chalice. I did not see that coming. Hopefully it's uh, good enough, though, to um, to have Blood Moon. Uh, so do I limp the stage? I think I do. Well, I can. Yeah, the, not gonna lie, the Chalice kind of caught me off guard. And so is just the Black Mana. Alright, well, at least I'm set up for a Blood Moon next turn. If it looks for sure like I'm going to play Blood Moon next turn, I probably should just play the uh, Lightning Bolt. I don't really know. This is this is bizarre. So I guess they are playing like some kind of Titan Field deck rather than rather than a uh, uh, Titan Bre. I mean Titan Shift. Okay, yeah, this is definitely not Titan Shift. That that's just bizarre. They had such a mana base that looked like Titan Shift. Literally no way to remove Relic, so why not? I mean, um, 
I mean, uh, Chalice. Well, let's hope that our disruption disrupts them harder than their disruption disrupts us. I don't know what else to say. <clears throat> the good news is there isn't that many enchantment removal with just black, although they did print that new card that loses them life and you can kill a creature or an enchantment. And I wonder if that's what we're going to see here. Okay. Well, I can live with that. Um, yeah, just have it. Just hope I'll hit a land. Yeah. If not, I can just bone crush. And I do think I'll probably want to bone crush just because. Just because playing, uh, just getting the game dealt with faster is probably in my best interest. I don't really know of too much they can play with one black mana that I'll really need to stomp. Alright, well, Giganta can also help out. I probably should have played the Firebolt, but... I can always do that next turn. Cycle this bad boy. It's one of the reasons in the deck. All right, well, didn't really get me anything good, but hey, uh, no real reason to crack. I mean, to this way, if they pyroclasm again, or more like a, I don't know, anger of the gods, or fire sprout, or something, I got I can play again the next turn, which is nice. Alrighty, I guess I'll take it against. Uh, Titan Field, normally I think it's a pretty bad matchup, but hey, with all this uh, prowess rushdown potential, maybe it's not as bad. Didn't get to see. It was a very extremely awkward game for both of us. Um, but, you know, all right, I guess our disruption out-disrupted their disruption. All right, I guess uh, that was pretty quick. Um, next time.